Hello there guys, it's me on Stable Voltage. Welcome back to episode 8 of Civilization 6. We are playing as Ramses II on Emperor Difficulty. And in the last video, I messed things up because I went over to this island with a settler and a couple of units to try and found a city and it was crawling with barbarians that were a lot stronger than I was expecting. The two city-states here were doing absolutely bugger all to help and it ended up with me losing the settler. But what I'm going to do, I'm one turn away from getting ballistics. We're going to upgrade some of our crossbowmen to um, field cannons. Uh, we're also going to build some field cannons and we're going to go over there and we are going to mess those barbarians up. So the first thing that we want to do is upgrade all of our crossbows to field cannons. First of all, it gives us a boost. Um, but also, having stronger units is going to make the AI less likely to attack. It's also like we've only got the three crossbows. Still got this warrior here that I can't upgrade because I still don't have any niter. Got a trade route plundered over here as well. as like an actual barbarian plundered my trade route, so that sucks. Can't do too much about that. Um, not likely to build trebuchets at this point. We could just hard build uh, siege tactics. That would give me renaissance walls. So at least that would give me a bit of extra housing as well. Or we could go in for replacement parts to get infantry. Infantry requires oil. We don't actually have oil yet. Um, let's get cartography out of the way. And then we'll come back to it and work out what we're going to do about oil. We are getting to the point where pretty much all of the decent units that we want, with the exception of field cannons, are going to require some po some sort of strategic resource, so got a little bit of trouble there. Hopefully Yerevan can take that uh, guy out, and they, they could not, apparently. Uh, this might be a little bit risky, taking this across, because I am potentially leaving the city undefended, but I have money, so I can always just buy one here if, if needs be. But this, un this field cannon should be enough to deal with most of those barbarian units if they don't all run at me at once. So you're going to get over there. We'll go on to the next turn. We will get some military units because we are woefully under-equipped right, right now. 20 gold and 5 faith from triangular trade. Is it worth replacing anything to get that for 20 gold? I mean, I can afford to lose the nine science. Getting the extra trade is actually really good because if we can get, well, the extra gold, because we are building Big Ben. And when Big Ben is complete, uh, let's get colonialism, it's boosted. Uh, when Big Ben is complete, it doubles the money in our treasury. So we want to have as much money in the treasury as possible. Um, yeah, there's cartography done. That was quicker than I expected. So yeah, if we go replaceable parts, we'll still need oil. We need refining for that, don't we? Uh, we need to go through to industrialization. Yeah, refining's here, which needs rifling, which needs military science, which needs siege tactics. So let's go for siege tactics anyway, so we can get those walls. We need to just work through all the prerequisites. Uh, we can claim a great person. It's another great merchant. Gain 200 gold and two envoys. Yeah, I'll take that. Again, uh, all gold is good gold. Uh, it doesn't matter where we pop them either because it's not city specific. So I'm going to choose our production here. So we've just completed the dam. So that's helped out with the housing a little bit. There are some wonders that we could build, but I don't think I'm going to. We could get another trader. We could get the stock exchange as well. I think it might be worth it. Try and really maximise our money before Big Ben completes, assuming that we get Big Ben, that is. Uh, we've lost a few suzerain statuses somewhere. Although we can get Mexico City. And that gives us another two error score, because we really need to start building that up. Um... Is there anything that you want to upgrade? We can't get the oil yet, so... Not a huge deal of stuff. There is some more sugar we can get over here, actually. So let's just move over there and grab that sugar. Because at least we can sell it, and then again, that will help us put in some gold in the bank. I stepped onto the rooftop of the Potala Palace. I There's Potala Palace done. So, an era score, a victory, victory point, and it gives us another diplomacy card. So... Raj, I think, was really good. It's 10 gold, 10 science, 10 culture, 10 faith. I think that's definitely worth having in there. So 161 gold per turn now. Another barbarian outpost. That one's definitely not my problem. 
Uh, and our next Civic is probably going to be... Mm. Let's go for the Opera and Ballet first, because it'll give us two more envoys. And we'll try and get some city-states on board. We don't even have medieval walls yet in the... Oh no, we need the Settler first. Let's get that sorted. Uh, six turns. Yeah, and you're going to go across here. We've got an envoy. We've got two envoys, actually. Do we want to try and kick anybody out first? Or do we just want to try and grab the ones that are easy to grab? Because we can grab you. And we can put another one in here and start working towards that. So there's another two error score. So what do we need now? Uh, four more. Discovered a new continent. Oh, that's because we've just made friends with it. Uh, become the suzerain of a city-state that had vision on it. That's fine. And we've met Theodora. The Byzantine Empire. Whereabouts are you located? Honour to meet you. Sample hospitality. So you are here, Constantinople. Um, so you're kind of to my west, really. So yeah, lots of city-state units around here. It's like, do any of you want to think about maybe getting rid of some of these units? Maybe? Getting rid of some of the barbs? There's Terracotta Army. That, that's, my Settler's still there, actually. If I can grab the Settler back, we're all good. I'll still keep the other Settler if I get to produ produce it. Oh yeah, because they don't have a camp to put it in, because I, I took the camp out. Now, they can actually sh... Mm, yeah. They can actually shoot me in the water. And they may. We'll see if they... They won't be able to take me out. We'll, uh, we'll have an embassy. Yeah, they are going to take a shot at me. I'm just trying to work out if it's worth landing and taking a shot at them. No, we took way too much damage there. Um... Am I the suzerain of Johannesburg? I am. Could levy their military. They haven't got an awful lot, though. What I'm going to do is I'm going to bring this guy down here if I can manage it. And we will... Uh, what do we want here? Military science. I'll bring him down here, land him up, heal, and then try and go out and take them one unit at a time. Oh, are you shooting at me from the water? Oh, wow. I didn't realise that he had a two-tower range. Oh, he moved, didn't he? So that's great. I've lost another unit. Brilliant. I'm not doing well today. Okay, in that case, I didn't really want to do this, but I'm going to. I'm going to buy a field cannon. Um, going to actually move you out. And I'm, I, I know I said I wanted to save up gold, and I do. But we're going to go over there with two field cannons. Now, Colossus, we can build. No, I was going to do the Venetian Arsenal, wasn't I? No suitable locations, because we don't own this tile. Uh, Venetian Arsenal will take 48 turns. We can build the Colossus there, so let's go for it. Lots of wonders. Uh, we've got two more envoys that we can send. So, I think we're going to try a nab Mittler away from Tomris. She won't be very happy about it, but we've got the Congo between me and her, so it's not that big of a deal. Uh, it wants me to do something with this worker now. There are some tiles I could potentially upgrade. Um... We haven't upgraded that copper. I suppose we could go ahead and do that. Very, very annoyed at losing those units now. Because thats it's just a waste. They, they all had um, promotions on them as well. So you're going to sit in there. That's the new unit. You're going to... Well, actually, no. You're going to move out as well. So I'll probably need another unit in here. But I'll hard build that one once the settler's done. Yeah, there's the settler. So the settler can go with you. You can group up. And then... I'll hard build 
I need more traders as well. We'll get another field cannon. Eight turns. And we've met Grand Columbia. Okay, so there's only one more civilization that we've got left to meet. You are located... Is that you? There's military science. Is that you over there? Yeah. Okay, so the other one's probably down here somewhere. So we definitely want to try and grab this island quickly if we can. Look at Mexico City with their army there. It'll take me ages to get across here. Where's my other unit? Choose the research. that We need rifling. There's a lot of warnings about stuff. Housing problems in Rakadet. We can build a dam down there, actually, but we're building Big Ben first, so... Be nice when we can get the oil, because that'll give us some production. Yeah, definitely going to go and take my revenge with these field cannons if I don't mess it up. You want horses and sugar. You want to give me some gold and a great work. I don't have any great works yet, so I'll take that, actually. I don't know what type of victory I'm going for yet, so... It's a mystery. They're spreading their units out, and I don't like it. Going to try and land in the city-state so that they... Um, yeah, I'm going to try and land in the city-state so that they can't just hit me before I land. Because that's what causes the problems. Suzerain status lost of Fez. Chichenets has been completed. I wasn't building that, so I'm alright with that. There's rifling done. Um, I mean, I guess we could get these pastures. Might as well use that worker up. Right, you should be out of range of being hit. You see, yeah, he's bringing units down here, which is annoying. So I'm going to try and go in this way if I can. Right, let's get refining. And then we can start to hook up all of that oil. There's ballet and opera done. So I don't think I need any of the policies from that right now, but that does give me two extra envoys. I think we can probably safely land on the next turn. My settler's still there. And you're going to move here and you're going to land on the next turn as well. Uh, choose a new civic. Let's just get Reformed Church done and out of the way. Two more envoys. It's Fez that we lost control of. There's six points in there now. We can go and just get uh, Mittler, though. And that's found as another goodie hut. All the way down here on this island that also has oil. But I'm not too concerned about that. I'm more concerned about what's going on over here and my units. We can probably settle two cities. There's two rivers. Oh, no, they're moving. There's only crossbows, though. Move in with you. I'm going to back up again. I'd sooner keep the units alive than lose them. You've completed the stock exchange. We could get the Renaissance walls because you are going to have housing problems soon. Or we could just get a preserve that would also solve the problem. Oh, the Great Zimbabwe. We probably want to build that down at... Um, uh, where can you build that? Requires market. Must be adjacent to commercial hub. Must be adjacent to cattle. Do you know what? I'm going to go for that. It's not the best uh, city. I'd have sooner have done it on this city. But this city doesn't have any cattle adjacent to it. Where any ugh, any tiles with cattle where I could do it, which is the problem, and that's a real shame because that would have been a good one if that were possible. Um, we've circumnavigated the world apparently, even though I don't think we have. But all right, right, he might move in over here. Let's go back here and heal up a little. Just got to be really careful here. Can't afford to lose any more units. If it takes me a couple of extra turns, then it takes a couple of extra turns. That's fine. Right, they're move he's moving units in now to try and attack me. Am I strong enough to deal with these guys? Oh, I'm not even sure if I am. 
I mean, I can definitely take one of the units out. I can definitely take one of them out, but I can't take both of them out. Let's take the weaker of the units out, because that's a guaranteed kill. And I'm just trying to thin out the number of units that are here to attack me. I'm also very tempted. How much is it, will it cost to levy their army? 485 gold. Do you know what? We're going to do it. I'm so sick of these barbarians now. Um, these units are terrible, but hopefully they'll provide a distraction and let me whittle them down. Um... You have completed the field cannon. Let's get... You're not housing capped yet. Let's get a bank. Uh, skip with you. Heal up with you. And you're going to get this cattle and... The, uh, sorry, this... Uh, sheep and these sheep. That field cannon can stay there. I think we're probably going to need another one. So yeah, I did lose that field cannon. There we go. So these units are now attacking the... the three great elements of modern There's Reformed Church. Now that's unlocked Theocracy, which we also don't want. So okay, now we have some units. I mean, some of them for no... Re right, one new population. That's great. I can use these units to capture the things as well. Uh, there's no point me levying their units because I think they've only got the spearmen, so that's a bit pointless. Let's get natural history now. There's Gran Colombia. I should be able to get my um, settler back here, though. Yeah, they're moving forward with units now. And if I can get them to come away from the water, then I can get the field cannon back over there. So we've got a trade route here in Thebes. Um, we're instead going instead of going to Mogadishu. My seventeen gold is nice. Uh, where's our trade route list? Trade route overview. Available routes. Um, my benefits. Can we sort by gold? I thought we used to be able to sort by particular resource. Maybe there's an, maybe there's an an add-on or a mod for it. The city states Shadet to Chihoka. So Shadet's even better than... So Origin City. Oh, their benefits, my benefits. Well, obviously I want my benefits. Um, let's just try and move it to Rakadet and see what the options are. Only takes one turn. Look at this. Congo's got anti-tank uh, there. This is like one barbarian camp that he's so overpowered right now. 15 to Cahokia is not great, is it? 15 to Mogadishu. 15 to Kamasi. None of the ones to Congo are particularly great. But I do like the ones that give me science or production as well. Um, let's go to the Mitla one because we don't have a, a trade post there. Right, now let's see if we can start weakening some of these units. We're probably going to do very little damage to them. See if we can go down and, like, take So I don't care if I lose all of these units. They're not mine. They belong to a city-state. That's fine. Let, let me lose them. I don't care. 
But it would be nice if we can at least thin some of these units out. Another turn and that field cannon will be healed up. And again, remember, barbarians don't heal, so... We are taking some damage, but that's fine. 100% uh, production towards buildings in this district. I quite like um, commercial hubs because I have quite a few of those. And new districts built by this player act as culture bombs. Prefer it to be me because at least then it's nobody else, right? Just stopping other people from getting it. That's all I care about. It is me and city, oh, city centre makes sense, doesn't it? Uh, let's get the sheepies there. Everybody here is fully healed up, so let's get you back over. Now then, you're going to do... No, well, before we do that, let's move you there for the um, flanking bonus. So I know I'm going to do next to no damage with these units. And obviously I'm not going to pay to upgrade them. And this is a major defeat. But if I can take some of these units down... And if I can get in there with the field cannon, I should get another field cannon in from the south, but we are we are whittling their units down. Okay, so he's coming and coming and giving us a weaken. Let's move you in there for adjacency. So this is another major defeat, but. And then I can attack either of those. Let's try and get rid of the ranged. Well, I mean, both of them are ranged as well. The ranges are ranged. There's my other settler. And yeah, we'll move there with you and we'll get that last cattle. Uh, we can get a great scientist. Alan Turing triggers computers uh, and another random technology from the modern era. We definitely want that. Uh, Alliance with Congo has expired already. That was really quick. I feel like we've literally only just had that. We've got to declare friendship again. How quickly do these alliances run out? And I wonder if we, who's got the most money. 384 gold. So, well, gold per turn. 86, 93, 140. His, mind you, his probably is the, the better for gold. She likes me. Theodora likes me. Could we declare a friendship? Yes, looks like she's happy with that. So shall we go and get, like, a economic alliance? No, no, okay. Um, what about a cultural alliance? One time, 12 gold. Sure, okay. We'll take some culture from that. Right. Alan, pop. Uh, we've got chemistry. Nice. Chemistry and computers. On to the next turn. This will probably be the last turn of this video. It's definitely going to be the last turn for these levied units. Right, you're going to grab that. You can finish off that unit, I think. It says minor victory. Yeah. <clears throat> and we're going to move you up here. So they've still got a crossbow that's weak. They've still got a ranger somewhere as well. Um, Thebes. Could get the stock exchange. What what were you working on? You were working on the bank. Um, I'm going to hard build another field cannon. I don't want to be caught out if the AI suddenly decides it's going to um, attack me. Right, I'm not bothered about the crossbowman. He can do very, very little damage to me right now. This isn't. This doesn't even want to tell me how much damage I'm going to do to these. Major victory. The thing is, if I embark now, he's still going to be able to take me out. So I've just got to try and hit him. And I can't get close enough to hit with you. So all I can do is come here and try and take this unit out. 
I might lose another field cannon here, but that is pretty much the only unit they've got left. And I can get my settlers back. That's not too much of a problem. There is a promotion on that, but it's not really worth taking. I did say that was going to be the last... Um, she wants to buy iron? Sure. Uh, I did say that was going to be the last turn, and then I forgot. So yeah, that's going to be another unit lost, but another era score. There's refining done. I do still have this unit here. Again, I'm not going to take the promotion. It's just it's a waste of time. I'm going to go over here. I might be able to land here and settle if I'm quick. I might not. We know we've got loads of sources of oil, so we can deal with that. Um, yeah, you're going to work your way over here. It's going to be slow going, but we'll get there. And now we can work on replaceable parts, because then we'll we'll be able to do that. We also want to get uh, 20 turns on the Great Zimbabwe. One turn for Colossus, that'll be done. Got an envoy that we can send... Is there anything that we want to try and snipe off somebody else? We can try and get Hong Kong. Right, so that is going to be the end of the video. And then next time... can't believe it's taken me three videos and I still haven't managed to settle a city over here. I've rushed it and I've made a mess of things. But I've got two settlers. So I can put one here and then I, I might just save the other one. I don't think it's worth settling a second city on this island. Might have a look and see what else we we can find um but at least we've got a spare but thanks a lot for watching i hope you have enjoyed this episode of civilization i hope you're enjoying the series if so please do consider leaving a like and subscribing if you haven't already i will see you on the next video until then goodbye for now